Pro Wrestling 225 family, I'm Spencer here with the competitors for the Fatal 4-Way Iron Man match at Iron Sharpens Iron. Champ Jordan Jaws here, Vladimir Koloff, Braxton Hunter, and Wes Warren. And these four men will be going the distance, 60 minutes on February 3rd, for this, the brand new SEC Championship. Now I want to thank all four of you for joining me. I want to remind you that Wild Thing has said that if anyone gets physical during this interview, you will be removed from the match. Does that include you? Me? No. No to. Now, I want to start with everyone. This is unprecedented in professional wrestling. 60 minutes, fatal four-way. What are each of you doing to prepare to last the whole hour, to be the Iron Man? What are you doing to prepare? Let's start with Vlad. Are you serious? Do you not realize what this is? This is a war. Why would I share my tactics with any of you? Understand this. I've stepped in the ring with each one of you three men. You've got the best of me, and I'm damn sure I've got the best of you, but I promise there will be a different Vlad, a bigger, a badder Vlad, ready to go all 60 minutes, and when the time comes, I will be the one to take that from you. We'll see. Hey, Brax, how's your head? Go to hell. That's what I thought. Let's, let's go to you, Braxton. What are you doing to get ready for the match? You know, when Braxton Hunter says he's reimagined, it's not just a gear change. It's not just uh, what some people call a character change. I have changed my entire life on this run. I went away for seven months and became a totally different person. And in, in those seven months, I put my body, my mind through hell. And I've continued to do that every single day since I've gotten back. Now, yes, you can talk about your, your running or you going to the psych ward and fighting whoever you want, or you, I don't know, being a piece of shit. I'm a wrestler. I wrestle. That's what I'm doing to prepare for this match, because that's what it's going to come down to. Who the best wrestler is in 60 minutes. That's cute. Wes Warren. You got something to say? You know, you've never beaten me one-on-one. -on -one. False, I have. Yeah, with someone's help. Mm, I don't recall yeah, it like a, that. Yeah, that's but, an absolute fact. But, you know, I, you know, I do see how you could forget that. You know, my memory's a lot better than yours, but trust <laughs> me. Sure it is. What I'm doing to prepare, I'm not changing anything that I'm doing. I'm not going to talk about wrestling. I'm not going to talk about being the best or whatever. I'm just going to continue doing exactly what I do. Because what I do earned me the SEC championship the first time, and what I'm going to continue to do is going to earn it to me a second time, something which you have never held. Okay, champ. Now, question is, am I worried? Hell yeah, I'm worried. You three dudes are animals, man. Am I scared? A little bit. But I'm kind of like Wes on this as much as I hate the dude, but I'm not changing anything. And you want to know why? Because in the last three years, I've been in the ring with Wes Warren more than six times. And you know how many times Wes Warren has pinned me? Zero. Vladimir Koloff. Let me remind you where this belt came from before I had it. Oh yeah, I remember. And to my baby brother, man, I love you to death, but man, February, I mean, October 28th at Fright Night, you just didn't get the job done. Oh, that's so so I'm not changing anything. I'm going to do the exact same thing that it took to get me where I am today. Oh, yeah, does that include the superhero at the very top, huh? Yeah, exactly. Oh, what about that chain? Yeah. Don't forget about that. Yeah. Yeah. We'll yeah. see. Okay. Oh, y'all love each other. That's so cute. How I you? <laughs> Shut your mouth. Love that. I actually want to bring up a point that Wes Warren made, if I can. Brax, you're the only one <sighs> of the four competitors that has not held the SEC championship. Now, you're one hell of a run, winner of the Mayor's Cup, right? But do you it's think true. you're at a disadvantage to these other three guys because they've been here before? No. 
Absolutely not. I think not having won the SEC championship makes me a lot hungrier than any of these men. Wes Warren, yeah, he won the title, but did he give a damn about it? No, it was just something for him to hold. Vlad won the championship, and it was just something he could hold over everyone's head, just so other people couldn't have it. Jordan, a fighting champion, and yeah, I haven't held the belt, but God damn it, if that timer hadn't ran out, you were gonna tap out or you were gonna pass out, and there's no doubt about that. Did it happen? It was close. It was close. How'd you feel after that? Almost doesn't count. Wes, in a lot of ways, you're the catalyst for this entire situation, right? You won the battle royal at Vendetta that gave you an opportunity at Jordan Jaws SEC Championship. But then after that, you formed your Cold War alliance <laughs> with Vlad. The question is, was it a mistake trusting Vladimir Koloff? Trusting Vladimir Koloff? I did. You ever seen that movie, That's... Dumb and Dumber? <laughs> Basically, Harry and Lloyd sitting right here. No, let, let, hey. me, let, let me ask this question for you real quick. How does it feel, Wes Warren, to feel like you were hey, going hey, to get, play me? Get, Shut, get, you, get don't you ever touch me. Don't get you guys. ever touch me. How does it feel to know that you got played by me, good boy? You thought you had me figured out. I played you like a fiddle. Cold War was never a thing, and you should have known that. I'm glad you friend. said that because I was going to say the same thing. To think that I ever trusted a guy who wears a mask is ridiculous. Why would I trust you? You're from Russia. You look like crap with your stupid mask on. And look way better than you, big boy. Oh, really? Is that why you cover your face up? I still look way better than you, Nobody big boy. would know because you cover your face up. Why don't you come do something about it? Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you do it. Hit me. Hit me right now. Hit me! Oh, you want to, don't you? Yeah, sit down, stupid. You'll have plenty of time in two weeks. Plenty of time in two weeks. Okay. Vladimir Koloff. Oh! What? Jordan Ja defeated you at Showdown to win the SEC championship. Braxton Hunter beat you to win the Mayor's Cup to earn his shot at the SEC championship. Did you get involved with Wes Warren's opportunity because you knew you had no other way back to the back? Where was my rematch? For the last year, Battle Royals, Mayor's Cup, where was my rematch? Dude, your breath stinks. I don't give a damn about that. Where was my rematch all this time? You earned it. You, you, want you, you and earned. your little overboys uh -huh. and wild thing and yeah. every damn thing ever. You Let's talk about it real quick. Let's nothing. talk about it real quick. Reimagined, reimagined. The only thing I've seen out of you is that you can't get the damn job done when it counts. You had your moment with him. Time ran out. Excuses. The, the only thing I've seen chance? out of you is whining and complaining for being so cold-blooded. You're too damn scared. Is that why to you were too scared out. to face me one on one? You had to jump me in the back, you coward, huh? I'll knock you out we right had a here right we had now. a match at Friday right night. What right you do? You jump me right in the back, now. and then you. What? You didn't have the you balls to face me one on one, you stupid son of a bitch. Biggest false idol in pro wrestling two two five. Keep you and your boy. You and your overboy. I'm gonna take that. I'll take this. There's a reason why we're both the champions. Right now. Yeah. Not you. Do something. Do something. Come on. Do something. Come on. Hit each other. You shut up, Wes. The fact remains. When the sixty minutes is done, I will stand tall. This is my year, this is my time, and no one, and I mean no one, is going to stop me! Jeez, calm down, psycho. Jesus. I thought I was a psycho. You yeah, have fun playing game. games with Santa Claus. I want to give each of you a chance to tell me why you think February 3rd at the North Park in Denham Springs, Louisiana, at Iron Sharpens Iron, why are you going to come out as the Iron Man and the winner of the new SEC championship belt. Let's start with Wes. Because I'm better than Vladimir Koloff, I'm better than Jordan Jaw, and I'm better than you, Braxton Hunter. <laughs> You're a funny guy, you know that? Uh, hilarious. Truthful, though. Mm. Very truthful. Mm. I don't think so, pal.
You know what makes me really sick about you, actually? Please tell me. Please. I'm not going to tell you right now. Please shut your mouth. You're dying to hear. Please. You know why I've been the SEC champion when you haven't? Because I have something you don't. I have the killer instinct. I have, I, I'll finish things when they're supposed to be finished. You had him in the ring for 20 minutes. 20 minutes. And what would you do? You didn't do anything. You have nothing to show for it except a loss, except a draw. And you're going to sit there and say that you're better than me or him or him? Dude, you're fighting an uphill battle here. Now, you don't also, forget. You also have something else called schizophrenia. We had a draw, but I pin you. Yeah, you got lucky. Ain't nothing about luck. Well, I recall the luck. last time a tag You never match. faced we me one-on-one on one at all. You. Jesus. Brax, what do you have to say to Wes? Yeah, these guys really get off hand quick. <laughs> Um, Wes, you're a bitch. I'm not worried about you. I never have been worried about you. Anytime you've ever beaten me, it's been by some stupid, underhanded tactic that you're known for. I've come to expect it at this point. Your game is shot, bro. You're done. You're done. I'm not worried about you in this match. Hell, I'm not even worried about Vlad in this match. <laughs> There's only one person in this ring that I haven't beaten, and that's you, Jordan. And you know as well as I do that until I pin you, this reimagination, this new Braxton Hunter cannot be complete. I cannot get to that next level in 225 until I pin you. And I get that, man. I get it. So you do what you got to do, and I'm going to do what I got to do. I'll see you there. While you push, just remember, I'm always going to push just a little bit harder. I know you will. Vlad, what makes you the Iron Man? Try not to scream too much. Because I am the very best in pro wrestling 225. The NMK virus is in full effect. And whether you want to admit it or not, you all have it now. See, Jordan John, in this match, I will expose you. Braxton Hunter, I'm just going to knock your ass out again. And Wes Warren, I'm just going to slap the taste out of your mouth over and over and over again for 60 minutes. You want to talk needs more cola? You're going to get more cola than you'll ever, ever be able to handle. <laughs> Jordan, it could be argued that the deck has never been stacked against a champion like it is against you at Iron Sharpens Iron. 60 minutes all three of these guys to deal with. Why are you gonna walk in to Iron Sharpens Iron with the belt? And why are you gonna walk out the Iron Man? Spence, it's cause I have to. I have no choice. Riveting. You know, if Vladimir Koloff wins this title, he's gonna take it and he's gonna just put it on his trophy case with everything else he has. If Wes Warren wins this belt, He's going to take it and he's going to hold it in the face of every 225 fan and he's going to spit on them. Yep. And if Braxton Hunter wins, well, his destiny is going to be complete. And the problem with it is if that I let any of those three things happen, I become nobody. I just become another guy on the Gulf Coast trying to get booked here, trying to get booked there. But don't forget... Pro wrestlers are uncommon people. But the overboys, we are the uncommon amongst the uncommon. And yeah, the, the cards are stacked against me. And people are talking trash already. I see it on the internet. I see the posts. Somebody told me the other day that maybe I'm not as good a wrestler as Christian. Maybe I'm just the favorite guy. Somebody said I'm the oldest guy going into this match. Maybe I've peaked. Maybe Braxton should have won at Fright Night. But don't you forget something, okay? From the first tag title run, the second title, tag title run. Hell, even when we lost to Disobey. From Christian winning the Rumble, the few we have with Corey, and the time I won this SEC title. You can't deny, you two can't deny, and you can't deny that nobody in this ring, nobody in the locker room, makes memories and moments in pro wrestling 225. Then Christian Blake, Brett Landry, and Jordan Job. To hell with me! And I'm gonna prove you! To hell with me! And I'm gonna prove all of the haters wrong. Just like I've been doing since January 1st, 1986. I prove people wrong.
Iron sharpens iron. 60 minutes. Fatal four-way Iron Man match for the SEC Championship. We'll see you there.